Hello everybody and welcome to VFR. We are here in the Reno Air Races expansion for Microsoft Flight Simulator. We are doing a qualifying run to set the field for what's going to be my first race. So I have done a couple time trials in the P-51. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, it's flying that close to the ground that fast. It, um, it requires a bit more precision than you might be used to in other disciplines and more than I would have, um, more than I would have thought. We're going to come around to the line now. Um, and I have only just kind of started to taste what fast feels like in this. So fair warning, not an expert in air racing or anything like that. But just starting to get a feel for it. And it is, it is good fun. We're coming in on the stretch here into turn four. And we're now we're going to get into the four, five, six. My quick. Too high. Get back down to race altitude. Yeah, coming off four, I'm always real high. And we are a little bit far. Here comes the concentration. It is, um, it's easy to get too high. It was definitely flying too high when I was doing my little pre release run. And then just handling that close to the ground, and you just, it. You really got to focus on being smooth through the lap to put down a fast lap. And that takes a lot of um, a lot of precision that you don't necessarily think associate with flying an airplane in an oval. That was a fifth best time. Minute two. So that I was putting down a minute 15 in uh, my time trial. This is uh, normalized. Everyone's in the same performance. So that shows you about the difference between, I guess, the airplanes and raw performance. Minute two, we're starting sixth. It is That's not terrible. It wasn't a great lap. But you start to feel when you're fast, and fast is smooth. We are off. Turn four again, coming in. I tend to come in pretty high. And really, I'm just going to have to... I'm going to have to block out some of the... What the people are doing here. That is a little more distracting than I would have thought. Man, and in traffic, you feel it too. So, so far, I'm really enjoying the flight dynamic aspect of it a lot more than I would have thought. That's um, a challenge flying. You, you feel it when you get close to the airplanes, when the prop wash. You feel it when you get close to the ground. It is more challenging than you would think. I'm going a bit wide into seven. We'll try and set ourselves up into a good exit into eight. Oh yeah, and adding the planes just adds a whole different element of control and consideration.
Yeah, it's just a much more dynamic experience than I would have thought. I think they do a great job of that, really bumping you around. So we've settled into a little bit of a groove here. We're running fourth. We are okay. Number two's hit a pile uh, or cut a pylon, so we'll see. I would love to get uh, number three here. And I think we can if we get a good run. I'm probably late on the turn in there. So it is real interesting, and you don't want to get too high, because if you get too high, that's altitude that's not being turned into speed. So this guy's taking a bit of a wider line into 7-2. And you see, I, you can see how much time I lost there by going too high. We're catching up a little bit now. Did he hit me? Oh. Why'd he hit me? <laughs> I didn't see him at all. But we're back into it. We're uh, still in fourth. Check your altitude. Get back down now. We were gaining a little bit. What? Oh, man. That sucks. Oh, boss, you're going to cut the corner. Get back down to racing altitude. Judges will penalize you if you stay up there. Oh, but now we're coming downhill, and I got him. I got him. I got Captain Boss. Come on. Careful. You're too high. If you continue like this, you'll be penalized.
and we're gonna hold forth. We are all right. So fourth place, not terrible, not last. Three gate people did not finish, and we've got bumped up to third, I think, from time penalties. So hey, don't take time penalties; it's free time. That's a lot of fun. On the podium, first race, we'll take it. Uh, we did crash. That's what happens when you crash into people. But man, that's that's good fun. I really like that. I'm going to screenshot that. That's a lot of fun. Well, all right. So thanks for watching, everybody. This has just been a quick one. We're going to dive into some of these airplanes and do a lot of more fun stuff. I think this has a lot of potential. It's, it's pretty fun and pretty... Um, it's a lot more nuanced and dynamic than I thought it would be. So definitely check that out. And uh, yeah, as always, take it easy.